Don't judge me for my hair right now. I just woke up, okay, and I'm getting the vlogging camera. Today is a big day because we are going Christmas tree shopping! <gasps> are you excited? Um, we just found out that we're freckle twins. Oh, you've you, got moles look, together. Cool, man. You have a freckle there, and mummy has a freckle there. We're freckle twins. What are we going to buy today? I buy the kids and my grandma. With Emmy and grandma and gramps, yeah. We're going to buy a Christmas, Christmas tree. tree. I'm so excited. Honestly, I couldn't sleep last night because I was so excited. This is the first Christmas that you know what's going on. <laughs> Whose birthday is it on Christmas? <laughs> Jesus, birthday. Look at the camera and you say, hi guys, good hi. morning. Good morning. Oh, <laughs> you're trying to run away. <laughs> say good morning. Good morning. And I love you. I love you. <laughs> good boy. I giggle, I giggle. <laughs> you giggle, dude. <laughs> yeah. We need to go. Gramps is waiting for us. Yeah, Let's Gramps go. is waiting. And none of us are Christmas tree ready. <laughs> Honestly, boys, boys, boys. Maybe we could all get crepes for breakfast. Yeah. Every year since, honestly, I was born, we get a real Christmas tree. It's like a tradition my dad started. So now that we live in our own home, we all go together. So I'm pretty sure we're meeting here. My dad, my older sister, my mom. I'm not sure if my little sister's coming to all buy our real Christmas trees together. And I'm so excited because this is the first year that Fox like really knows what's going on. Give me your Christmas ready outfit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm bringing a massive bag because if we're going to go to the farmer's markets, we may as well get some fruit and veggies and meat and eggs. So hopefully we can get some groceries and also get a tree. But we do have a game plan. If the farmer's market doesn't have Christmas trees, we're just going to like jump around to places until we find it. one. Totally. Bring that. Let's go. Yeah, we'll play Christmas carols. <gasps> do you want to play Christmas carols? <laughs> I get anxiety when we're late. My dad's one of those people who's like, if you say you're gonna be there at 8.45, you better be there at 8.45. We said we're gonna be there at 8.45, it's 8.49, and we live like at least 25 minutes away, at least. Your fault, not mine. No, it's not my fault. Yep. It's all of our fault, it's Matt. Foxy's. Bro, you need to get up earlier. <laughs> He's so not faced. Yeah, you didn't get up. Yeah, you didn't get up in time. You just kept sleeping in. So wait, we don't get to come and pick it. No, you can, but there's just not many, so we're trying to tag them if we can. We want a massive one. That's the biggest one here. Should we just do it? Yeah, tag her up. That's any kind of. How? How any? This one, I'm telling you, it is so competitive. Em's like, people are standing there, like waiting to get their trees. She's like, we have to tag it now. We have to pay for it for you. I feel like now we have a family house. We need like big Christmas decorations because we have just little apartment ones. But now we're in a house. Okay. Like no, lock Santa in our front no, yard. No, I'm not going. I don't. I don't want to become that house that people feel Come obliged to. to walk up the driveway, <laughs> like Fox last night. I do. I got a couple of Christmas lights in the tree. That's it. That's all you're getting straight. That's right, I'm sorry. Guys, I'll put a blob. I'm Grinch. I'll put. I'll. Yes, let's get a blob Grinch. That's no, a great idea. Yes. That is such a good idea. Don't touch my lawn. Or even better, you can dress up as the Grinch every night and just sit at the door. Yeah, get off my lawn. <laughs> <laughs> like, there's like four songs on there, isn't it? That's yeah. all pentatonics. Yeah. Look, I need to build her out, but <laughs> the four songs that are on here. You, you talked it up like it was the world's greatest playlist it is, ever. It's, it's got four songs on it. It is. <laughs> See, he likes it. It's good. I didn't say it was bad. I just said you've only got four songs, so don't amp it up too much. Yeah. Very skinny. They're all coming up. You reckon? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you reckon, Dad? Yeah, I mean, we've got it now. What do you so... reckon, Fox? Is that okay? This is your Christmas tree, buddy. Tree? Happy birthday, Fox. Happy birthday. <laughs> you better move off the road. You want this one? Yeah. Could you carry it to the car? You yeah, come on, you get down and you no. carry it. No, you carry it. Me carry it? Yeah. I'm too weak. No, I'm you old. Carry it. I'm old. You're too big. <laughs> right. You're big. You carry it. <laughs> there you go. Santa. Farm. Yeah, I reckon he's down there. Yeah. Maybe we can get okay, baby Chino's crepes and see Santa. Santa! Yeah. Was it really 160 bucks? Yeah, I got 10% off because I got three. Oh my god. But that's it, look, honestly. Oh, that's good. Last well, year was 150 like, and we no, were laughing. Last year it was 200 and something bucks. No, it wasn't. Oh, well, no, it was 150. It was 150. It was 200. It was 100. Okay. I have it on vlog. Do you guys think I over exaggerate? He. It's, it oh, it's, so all right, flashback here. <laughs> flashback here to last year's vlog. The $200. What? But Pretty sure it was 150 bucks. Oh my god, it's Santa. Let's go. Okay, we'll go see Santa. It's fine, I only have toddler 
neighborhood once, but it's fine. You want to see Santa? <laughs> Someone a bit jealous? Come on, let's Come on, let's I, I don't because... Who is it, bud? Santa. Are you excited? Yeah. Mommy, buddy, the whiskey bar. Fox, make sure you, oh, wow. yeah, oh, make sure you, make sure, make sure you're asking for the whipper sniffer in the mall tomorrow, okay? Okay, come on. And an Aston Martin. And an Aston Martin. Thank you very much. Thank you. I want the whiskey bar. Oh, an Aston Martin. What do you want? I want the whiskey bar. Aston Martin, Santa. You want to sit on there? You tell him what you what do you want for Christmas? What, what do you want for Christmas? Hey Santa, hey Santa, I'm my evil, I'm my whiskey bar. He wants a whip, a sniffer, and a leaf blower. What a great present! <laughs> Beautiful. Thank you. Say thank, thank you. Bye, 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 Santa. Bye, Santa. Who's that? So I want a whiskey bar, evil. Yeah, I think oh you're gonna get God. one now. I want a whiskey bar, evil. Is that cool? Everyone, if you're local, come to the Soulful Pantry because you can get body blue. Who's this? Is? Who makes this? Mummy. Yes, yeah, mommy. good job. successful. Fox fell asleep in the car. He's awake, but he's chilling in his bed. So hopefully he has an actual nap. Look at this bag. Like this is all the organic fruit and veg we got. So we got two dozen organic free range eggs. And then we went to like a grass fed organic butcher and we got eight grass fed lamb cutlets, grass fed beef mints, chicken and herb sausages. Oh, I thought this was fun. Like usually I'll make this stuff at home like myself, but I figured this would be really awesome for days that like I'm running late and I just want to have something home cooked. This is lemon and oregano chicken, like a whole chicken. I read somewhere that if you crave ice, you're iron deficient or like your body's craving iron. And the last two days I've been craving ice, like chewing on ice. So I just wanted to get some more red meat. So we got four grass fed eye fillets. Okay, time for the big mama. We got some rockets, a big thing of kale. I think this is English spinach or Swiss chard, whatever, like some kind of green spinach. A huge head of broccoli. I want to try these organic cherries. Don't you think cherries remind you of Christmas? Yeah, cherries. And there's the only time of year I eat a cherry. Mm. Okay, so we got cherries. We got some vine ripened tomatoes. Smelly wee vegetable, aka asparagus. I love asparagus, but I don't love the aftermath. Fox's favorite vegetable of all time, organic corn. We got some green beans, zucchini, fresh mint. I don't have a game plan for this. It'll either be in like a big salad or just like water. There's this cafe I go to and I get smashed avocado on this charcoal bread and they put mint on top of it and just like the mint and lemon. Bananas, let's hope these ripen properly because they're pretty green. The only thing I hate buying organic is avocados because they're so small. <laughs> like this was like five bucks or something for two of these. We got two passion fruits, a huge cucumber. We got some green apples. Oh, I squished one. Oh, I squished two. And they're so expensive. We'll wash it and we'll taste test it. It's a tiny organic yellow peach. Mmm. I'm at the end, I swear. Organic raisins from the Soulful Pantry. Uncontaminated gluten-free oats. You can't technically call them gluten-free, but they don't deal with any other ingredients in the factory that deal with gluten, so uncontaminated oats. So last but not least, some LSA, which is linseeds, sunflower seeds, and almonds, I'm pretty sure, ground up. And that is everything we bought. So I will catch up with you guys when Fox either is out of bed. Yeah, I wouldn't be mad if he skips his nap because I'm just too excited. I want to put the Christmas tree up and make this house super festive. What, what was here? What did we just move? The toys. Yeah, and what, what kind of bench? My tool bench up there. Yeah, so normally Fox's tool bench is there, but we've moved it into his room. Well, well, this is the nursery. So we're still kind of in the process of getting him out of this room. This is obviously the nursery. So this will be the new baby's room. But for now, it's Fox's work room. He's moving upstairs soon when he gets his big boy bed. We should probably roll that up and put it upstairs in his room. Yeah. We should probably roll that up. Before we 
start decorating and make the house all festive, we need to get in character. Do you want to get changed into some Christmas clothes? No. Oh, yeah. <laughs> By the time this vlog is live, my Christmas pajamas have launched. So as you may remember, I think it's like the last three or four years. Every year around this time, I come out with Christmas pajamas. This year, my collection is called the Moon Days Pajamas Collection, Moon Days. And I have two different options. This one is called the Zora in the color Sweet Pea and it's 100% cotton. So if you like more of like that linen cotton feel, then this one is for you. And it has the little SD detailing, but it's just like a cool checkered set. A lot of my friends have actually said they're gonna wear as like lifestyle pieces. Wow, I reckon we should put this on the top of the tree. Anyway, so this one is called Zora. I personally think this is my favorite, as you guys can probably tell, and I've said on Instagram. My favorite color at the moment is green, so I'm just loving this sweet pea color. And I also like this fabric. And then this one is called Asara, and this one is in a really soft jersey. So if you prefer sleeping in really soft Dad. fabrics, that's me. <laughs> That's me when I was like five. And a cross. Uncle Willie carved that. So this one's in a really soft jersey in the color light sand. And this one, yeah, is called Asara. Again, I'm wearing a medium, but I'll try them on for you now. So I designed them to all be oversized. I'm wearing the medium. I could technically still be the small, but I just like the extra length. This one's my favorite though. I just like it like that, like tucked in with one. It looks... Oh. This one? Is this one your favorite, Kurt, or do you like the light sand one? Ooh, I think, ooh, I don't know. That's the first option, and Asara will put the soft jersey ones on. This one is called Asara, so as we can see, I think it's slightly smaller, like a slightly smaller fit. This is still the medium, but it's in the soft jersey, and it's still really oversized. It goes down at the back. They both have a drawstring. But this one is like kind of like a stretchy, soft jersey fabric. So it's really, really cozy. So two of my friends are pregnant at the moment and they'll be giving birth around the same time as me. So they've asked for this one because it's like the perfect postpartum material, like for your baby to snuggle up on. All right, I'm going to put the green on and we're going to get decorating right, this hey, space. Come outside, help me get the tree. Full fed. Big head. Come on. <laughs> Full fed. Big head. Oh, I cut it. You want to cut it? Yeah. All right, go. I cut it. Yeah, mate. Oh, she is skinny. She's a skinny tree. <laughs> oh my gosh. She'll pull out a little bit at the bottom. Oh, yeah. that, that looks a bit better. My goodness. Oh my goodness. Do you want to feel him? I uh, hear me. You want him to hear you? Uh, yeah, well, come, and, come and talk to him. <laughs> Bubba. Say hi, Baba. Baby, baby. He can hear you. Uh. Did you know that? He can hear you now. Do you remember when you were in Mummy's tummy? My, my again. You want to go to my tummy again? Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean? Again. You can't go in there again because you're out here. Once you're out, you can't go back. This is your Santa sack for when Santa drops all your presents off. Look, Fox. Bubbles. Fox, Santa will put all your presents in this sack. Should we put that down? Do you want to put that on the floor so Santa comes? No, I need to put it up there. Put the floor. Are you kidding? The heck's Do you not understand does, does how not to get presents? Do you understand he gets presents? Do you want to put this on the ground so Santa comes and gives you presents? Yeah. I think you should. I think you should. I think you should. <laughs> Santa's been really good to you this year. Okay. Every year this face of Sarah goes, goes the to front. the back of the tree. This needs to move. And this is the head of the house, mummy. It's gonna get moved to the back. <laughs> Maybe the floor. I love this game. Bring it on. Bring it on. Look, she's beautiful. She is stunning. Done. Christmas <gasps> is done. We can pack it down. That's it. It's all over. <laughs> we had fun. It was a good year. Hey, at least we put the Christmas tree up early this year. I know. It looks last so year, good. Last year we did it like a week before or something. I know. <laughs> it looks so good. I love her. You're plucking your eyebrows. What are we doing, Fox? Um, I think I can wash eyeballs. You're gonna wash, wash eyeballs? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you weirdo. Wait, what are you and Dad gonna do? Take your dummy out. What are you and Dad gonna do? I want eyeballs. No, we're gonna watch a movie. You're gonna watch a Christmas movie. And who pulled the doona out here? Please. 
Yeah. Here you literally go. literally goes, I'm cold. So I went to our room, pulled a king size dune out here, and said, Okay, I watch a movie. <laughs> it's not funny. <laughs> Get your dummy out of your mouth, you little well, goose. Eat eyeball. And eat an eyeball. Great. It's yeah. not Halloween, it's Christmas. Eyeball. All right, let's watch Elf. Let's watch Elf. Now, I know my saying is act confident and no one will question you, but I'm kind of embarrassed. Let me show you. Let me show you what we're working with. Don't judge me. Like, be nice, okay? I'm trying to do my best. So, it dried in the middle part. I flicked it to one side. Like, it just looks ugly. What am I doing wrong? Is it ugly? Would we all just be more comfortable if I just put my hood on and hid my face from the world? <laughs> I'm gonna do my skincare routine because it's the end of the day. I wanna show you guys some stuff that I think you should get for Christmas or like get your friends and family for Christmas. Because this was such a Christmassy, fun, festive vlog, I partnered up with Esme to give you guys a huge discount if you're looking for presents for like your sisters, your friends, or just anyone who's kind of interested in skincare. I personally love getting skincare for Christmas, whether it's like serums, skin tools, even things like this. So just for Christmas, I have a 20 percent off code for Esme Skin Minerals. If you want to get it by Christmas, I suggest ordering before the 15th of December. The code is SD20. So I have just a little bit of natural foundation, blush, eyebrow pencil, and mascara. This is my favorite cleanser. You guys have seen it multiple times before. I've had like four or five bottles of this. This is awesome for sensitive skin, but this is the Probiotic Skin Milk Cleanser. So I will do a double cleanse because I have foundation on. I just wet my skin first. For the first cleanse, I just use a pea size amount and I'll massage it into my skin. As you can see, it's kind of dislodged already. And then I just wet my crocheted hand, towel, whatever you want to call this. And then I gently just swipe up ways. So this first step is just getting the makeup off. And then my second cleanse is kind of like getting deeper into my skin, getting deeper into the pores and removing any like excess dirt or just like any leftover makeup. I think a cleanser is an awesome present because it's very practical. I'm gonna go ahead and say nearly everyone uses a cleanser. If you want something more special and unique, then definitely go for one of the next products I'm gonna show you. Here is one I've been loving. I've like, I've used a fair chunk of this. I'm like down to here on this one. This is the Refreshing and Hydrating Skin Snack. And it's just a skin mist, super, super fine. Almond oil, acai oil, kiwi seed oil. I really use and abuse this product. So I'll use that in between my steps because as you guys know, I like to apply my hyaluronic serum with damp skin. Esme's hyaluronic skin treat does come in this size, which is better for a present anyway, because it's just like more affordable and it gives that person a chance to kind of like try it out. This is one of the most popular serums at the moment. So I feel like this is an awesome present. Yeah, my 20% off code lasts until I think the 24th of December. But yeah, if you want to get it for Christmas, just getting quick because we all know Christmas shopping is crazy. I forgot to do my exfoliant. Anyway, my favorite exfoliant from the website, I think it's Bamboo and Rose. Rose and Bamboo Exfoliant. This is an awesome one if you have sensitive skin, but you still want to kind of get rid of any dead skin cells and smooth out the skin. Now, as we can see, I've used like a fair bit of this. I said I was going to update you guys if I liked this or not, and I love it. It is the Probiotic Milk Serum. I know this isn't a very measurable word, but I feel like it just makes my skin look really healthy and nourished. So I put a little bit on of that. And then I'm gonna do an extra spray because we're bougie like that. And then I'm gonna finish up with Esme's best selling product. This is the 24 karat gold nourishing oil. If you're not sure what to get your friend and you wanna get them something like cute and fancy and like skincare, look after yourself vibe, then this is always a safe option because everyone loves it. But if you wanna try any of the Esme products or even just stock up, then like I said, my code SD20 is valid until the 24th of December. I will link it in the description box below. So if you just wanna click that and shop, you can go for it. Thank you, Esme, for sponsoring today's video. I'm going to leave you guys with a few clips of us um, looking at Christmas lights for the first time. I think we're even going to go tonight, so if I have extra clips, I'll put them in there. But I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, give it a like because it really supports my channel, and make sure you subscribe because I upload new fun videos every single week. Bye! Happy birthday! Oh, wow. Happy birthday. oh that was a puddle! <laughs> I love how he just goes straight down into the. <laughs> like, my, no regard. My, my house, my house. Laser man. Ooh. Oh, my baby! <laughs> oh.
That was pretty cool. Overwhelmed with emotion. Straight in the first <laughs> Just straight up. Come back. The door's open. <laughs>